So, I'm a drummer and I love Genshin Impact. And more specifically, I've got a soft spot for Liyue. Liyue is my favorite region in Genshin Impact. There are so many different aspects that make it feel special to me and one of those is the music. And today we have been treated to an official upload for Scenery and Sentiment Liyue Edition. Let's go ahead and jump in and check this out. Oh man, and it starts with this dude. I just, oh is this animated? I thought it was going to just be still art. I love, I don't know this name of this song. But I love this piano part, especially in the upcoming section where they start going a little bit high with it. Oh my gosh, it just hits me in the feels. And how about this? Hang on, we need to go back to we we got the Adepti. There's their table and the tree. And then we've got the Adepti going by Azdaha's tail right there. I, I know technically not his tail or whatever, but hey, what a great quest that was. There's the pillars. Oh man, I I just freaking love Liyue gamers. I really do. There it is. That's my man, Moon Carver. Let's hear that deep voice, brother. Right here. Oh. Damn, bro. It's making me like emotional. Oh. Oh man, this making me tear up, dude. I I just I freaking love Liyue, and this music is so pretty, the scenery, and it's like taking me back, man. This reminds me of when I first started playing Genshin Impact, and it reminds me of why I fell in love with Genshin. Honestly, that might sound dramatic to some people. Oh, that's so nice. Damn, I'm actually getting emotional over this video right now. There's Go, but there's the Pyro Archon. Finally, some comedic relief. So I can get out of my feels a little bit. My man, Xiao. Madame Ping! Oh, look at the glaze lily! What a nice touch! We're gonna see my boy Zhong Li. We got to, right? Yeah, there he is. Dang, what a shot from the chasm to, ah, oh, wow, that was nice. Yeah, that was really nice. My my eyes actually welled up multiple times. I let's watch the video again and try and just listen to the music. I was just kind of gushing the whole time. I know this is supposed to be like a drummer reaction. There is literally no proper percussion in this song, and I love this song. I'm pretty sure I have this song playing in my teapot in Genshin. So let's let's rewatch the video and try and soak in the musical aspect rather than just the scenery and sentiment, if you will. So I know I said there's no proper percussion. Technically, a piano is a percussion instrument. And we're going to hear, especially in the second section of this song, where it really picks up and gets really busy, that is, in a lot of senses, the percussive backbone of the song. And even here, you hear the low notes on the piano. I would venture to say that that is serving as the percussion for this first slower section. It's basically just hitting on the one. You hear that? We still have that low note. That's just hitting on the one. That's marking a return to each measure. And there it walks up a little bit, just on the one, two, three, four. And then we're back to the start of the measure. This is one of the reasons why I love piano so much. I, piano's my favorite instrument. I don't know if I've ever said that in these videos or on streams. Oh. Ah, oh, there's the strings. Now I'm going to get emotional again. But there's just... As far as composition goes, 
when you pair a brilliant writer and composer with brilliant musicians, there is so much you can do with just a piano. And this song is a great, great example of that. Oh my gosh, this animation is just gorgeous. Just imagine what the official Kenshin Impact anime is going to look like. With like a full anime production team behind it. Holy crap. So that's the newest addition to scenery and sentiment from Genshin Impact. Liyue, like I said, very personal for me. I love Liyue. I said it a couple times throughout the video. I just get so nostalgic with Liyue scenery and music. And Liyue, like first entering that region and exploring the early stages of Genshin Impact. And I will never forget that feeling of climbing a mountain on the edge of Mondstadt and then looking over and seeing orange and yellow and different bodies of water and these giant pillars in the distance and just being awestruck and taken back. And that specific moment was when I knew that I just loved Kenshin Impact. So this video, thank you Hoyle for making this video. This was really, really quite the treat for me to watch and experience. I hope that you guys watching felt the same way. Thank you for experiencing it with me. If you like the video, thumbs up gang, where you at? And in the meantime, always love the games, love yourself, and I love you, 